okay let's go for the next one which is matching based there are two lists first the number of polynomials for fx with non-negative integer coefficients of degree less than equal to 2 let's consider fx as a naught x square plus a1 x plus a2 it is given that f0 is 0 so the constant term is 0 it is not required to write a2 we can simply say fx is a naught x square plus a1 x next they are saying satisfying f0 equals 0 and integral 0 to 1 fx dx is 1 integral 0 to 1 fx dx means a naught by 3 plus a1 by 2 is equal to 1 now a naught a and a1 are integers so we observe that the only possibility is a naught 3 a1 0 because non-negative integers are required 3 by 3 plus 0 or a naught is 0 a1 is 2 so we observe there are two possible cases that is for p the correct code should be 2 for p correct from the given codes we can see that p2 means the possibilities are b and d a and c are ruled out i can see for q both are giving me 3 so it is not required to solve q but if we check it the number of points in the interval at which sin x square plus cos x square attains its maximum value sin theta plus cos theta is attaining maximum value means theta can be pi by 4 9 pi by 4 13 pi by 4 etc we can search out the values like that okay when i go for x square equals pi by 4 so both are positive correct next 2 pi plus pi by 4 correct that is 9 pi by 4 so we observe there are two possibilities for x square means x gives me only four possibilities so for q it goes four so this is correct third one minus 2 to 2 3x square 1 plus ax dx fourth one minus half to half cos 2x log 1 plus x upon 1 minus x dx and so on i can see s numerator is odd function so the integral will be 0 this value will be 0 means for s the correct term should be 4 for s the correct term is 4 means d must be correct so it is not required to solve again r but if i solve r it can be solved like 2i equals let's consider this term as i if i replace a plus b minus x i get 3x square upon 1 plus e to the power minus x minus 2 to 2 3x square upon 1 plus e x plus 3x square upon 1 plus e minus x dx writing it as 1 by e x simply we observe 1 plus e x is cancelled out giving me the result as minus 2 to 2 3x square times 1 plus e x upon 1 plus e x hence we get the solution part but without solving it even then we have the result as d let's go for the next one okay let's go for next one that is 58 let y equals cos of 3 cos inverse x x line in the interval minus 1 to 1 but not equal to plus minus root 3 by 2 then we have to find the value of 1 upon y multiplied with x square minus 1 into second derivative of y plus x times derivative of y now it is given y as cos theta we can differentiate it it gives me dy by dx equals minus sine of 3 cos inverse x multiplied with 3 upon minus root 1 minus x square simply square it on both sides we get sine theta term which can be written sine square theta after squaring then we can change it to 1 minus cos square theta that is we change it back to the form of y 
differentiate it again simply we get this result equals 9 so correct code for this one is fourth let's go for the next part that is q a1 a2 up to an be the vertices of a regular polygon of n sides with its center at the origin let a k vector be the position vector of the point a k where k is from 1 to n one constraint is given over cross product of a k and a k plus 1 its magnitude equals summation over a k dot a k plus 1 then the minimum value of n is now we are talking about a regular polygon let's consider a1 a2 a3 and so on as the vertices o as the center we can see the angle is 2 pi by n area of this triangle that is simply half r square sine 2 pi by n so the given constraint is nothing but simply it gives me r square sine pi by n into 2 so that's the only thing we are obtaining from this cross product see this mod a k mod a k plus 1 sine theta angle between the two angle between the two that is 2 pi by n so mod a k mod a k plus 1 sine 2 pi by n on the left hand side similarly mod a k mod a k plus 1 cos 2 pi by n on the right hand side summation from 1 to n minus 1 so we simply obtain n minus 1 r square sine 2 pi by n equals n minus 1 r square cos 2 pi by n that is we are getting tan theta equals 1 correct so on cancelling it we left we are left with tan theta equals 1 that is tan 2 pi by n equals tan pi by 4 giving me on simplification n equals 8 so the correct code for this one is 3 when we look at the options 4 3 4 3 when we solve 4 it was sufficient to go for q as it will be 3 now we are left with two more go for the next one now the part r if the normal from the point p on the ellipse is perpendicular to the line x plus y equals 8 then the value of h normal from the point p on this ellipse let's consider a general point on the ellipse as simply a cos theta b sin theta form that is root 6 cos theta comma root 3 sin theta so we can write the normal at a point is root 6 x by cos theta minus root 3 y by sin theta equals 6 minus 3 that is 3 so this is the equation of normal this normal is passing through the point h comma 1 let's pass it through h comma 1 also given to me the slope of the normal is obtained from this line because the normal is perpendicular to it its slope is minus 1 so slope of normal is 1 that is from this equation we have the slope of the normal as root 6 by cos theta multiplied with sin theta by root 3 so from here we get tan theta equals 1 by root 2 we get tan theta as 1 by root 2 that gives me sin theta and cos theta substitute sin theta cos theta here and pass it through h comma 1 on simplifying we get h equals 2 that's clear last one number of positive solutions satisfying the equation tan inverse 1 upon 2x plus 1 plus tan inverse 1 upon 4x plus 1 equals tan inverse 2 by x square it's simply application of tan inverse x plus tan inverse y 
solve tan inverse x plus tan inverse y equals tan inverse of 2 by x square. We will be getting a quadratic equation on simplifying we get two possible solutions for x as so on solving we get x equals 3 and 1 negative value which is not required so there is only one possible solution that is this option so from the given quotes we choose a as the correct one let's move to the next matching